Okay, I'm back for some more abuse. Hey, there's her pancake. Welcome back. All right. Um, really? Hmm. Okay, so <clears throat> we've escaped the lab successfully. I do need to go back to that library and get all the books. Then I'd like to come upstairs and do some crafting and reading. I do have the fast reader trait and a good intelligence, and uh, we'll be able to get a bunch of good scallops done pretty quickly. Then I'd like to go back in the lab and get back into a few of those other areas. Um, but I do need to secure my food and water sources first. So upstairs, I don't have anything but the lit room here that I can craft in. And a sleeping room here I can get some raw materials from. Uh, I'll bang all this stuff up for raw materials and such in a bit. I also need to head back down and make a brazier. What's my fab? Fab 1, I think. <clears throat> yeah, fab 1. Uh, so I need to get some sheet metal, get a brazier put together. Also bring up some electronic parts. I got a lot of stuff I need to bring back up. Um, Alright, let's head back down again. <laughs> Hopefully my memory of these regions won't fade so fast that I can't get to where I need to be. Alright, first down was... Oh god, I gotta start remembering these paths. I think over there. Uh, this is where I had that thing chasing me, wasn't it? Yep. Hey there, man hack. Damn it. <laughs> Okay, this floor I gotta spend as little time as possible on. Um, okay, this floor I haven't finished exploring, and it's. Not remember where my laboratory was. I think it was another floor down. All right, was this my la yeah? That's my laboratory floor. All right. So we'll at least get the laboratory or the library. Don't mean to keep saying laboratory. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hey there, books. All right, let's grab cider, fruit juice, orange juice. Mm, don't really care about the rest of this. Okay, library's cleared. If I remember right, this was a short floor. Next floor down was the treasure room! Holy crap! <laughs> Uh, I knew it was a treasure floor. I didn't realize that was going to drop me two spaces away from a uh, sentry bot. Hopefully he doesn't come up the stairs after me. That would kind of suck. Uh, what I was deciding is, am I going to have any chance of actually installing CBMs, and do I bother? I'm going a heavy mutation route. I should at least grab the anesthetic kits at a minimum. Okay, 
Um, trying to remember if there's anything else on this floor I care about. Let's delete that note. We're done there. I don't want to <clears throat> I don't want to read anything or try to break into any locations until I get my computer skill up some more. So let's just get this stuff upstairs. Hello. Um, oh, hi. <laughs> I just got back up because I never killed him. Um, great. Is this not the way I came up? Nope, that's the one over there. Alright. <clears throat> I'll leave those guys in there. Alright, the next floor is the one that's got the uh, giant mole rat. Very can. Oh yeah, this is my home floor and the bionic vault. Um, It's my high night vision. <clears throat> Come on, genetic chaos, give it back to me. This is pretty big. Damn skitterbots! Arrgh. Oh, there's multiples. Arrgh. This is super dangerous here. Could be a turret that's gonna have line of sight on me. Uh, that's not good news. Prisoner containments. Don't care about prisoner containments. That seems to indicate another mole rat. And, and there might be another way to get to it from over there. Uh-oh, it's my favorite kind of place. Do we risk it? Jeez, 
turrets, turrets, turrets. Oh man. Another prisoner containment. Uh, I really should wait. room with the skitter bots I never fully looked into it so this floor is looking uh, we got a few places we can go actually up north and over here this is a big floor hmm. Standpipe. Thirty-nine. If we try to grab that, huh? Um. Thing still completely crazy with man hacks. Oh, stairs up right here. Oh, that would have been nice to know about a little while ago. Oh man, uh, right in the middle of the area that I was running around. Another <clears throat> This is the top floor. This should be a fish. for me.
Hey there, zombie technician. Uh, multiple zombie technicians. This room is weird. zombie technicians. I got stuff to do. Damn it, they're everywhere. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna have to leave this room alone for the moment. Whoa, hello scientist. Where'd you come from? Ideally, I need to go right through there, but I think I'm going to have to go back around. Ouch, punk. Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> Leave one behind just to get a tick tack by another. All right. Well, we got a pretty good stack of stuff out of there. <laughs> so there's our list. We can go computers to eight. <clears throat> so I'd like to do that. I think I've got enough food to last a day or so. Why don't we take some troglodyte serum and go to sleep? Okay, Dragon Bite Serum, what are we going to get? We got Substance Tolerance, an Albino, and Strong. Eh, Albino's not going to be the best. That's going to be a little unfortunate when we're outside. Uh, sunburn easily, typically use an umbrella and sunglasses when going out in the sun. Yeah. What of this do I care about right now? Albino, Strong, Webwalker, Chitinous... Heat dependent. I think overall I've got too many bad things. I should probably, uh, I think I'm going to purify, reset things. I lost my night vision. So I'm not too excited about any of the other stuff I'm seeing here. I think I'll, well, we'll see. Let's, let's go ahead and sleep. <clears throat> Don't remember. Oh, night vision just went back to high night vision. <laughs> oh, you bastard game. As soon as I mention purifying, they give me a little tiny, tiny little bonus. They give me my high night vision back just to try to keep me from doing it. I see how you are, game. All right, how bad is the sunlight going to hurt me here? Um, mouth and hands are cold. Am I wearing sunglasses? I forget. I don't think I... Yeah, I am. I'm wearing sunglasses, and I've got cover on most of my body parts, but I don't have... Oh, it's raining. Uh, probably direct sunlight might be damaging. We'll find out. 
All right, let's have. Oh crap! I forgot to make my. I need to go on a raw material harvesting binge. There's all the computers I might need for those components for my atomic lamp and such. Um, there's the. Does this floor actually have a living area? Yeah, it does. All right, I need to go to that living area. Can I get to it from... yeah, I can. All right, cool. God damn it, everywhere I go, man, Hex! All right. Do, do, do. Um, anything else? Not enough room, huh? All right. Uh, take the amplifier circuits, the copper wire. Uh, actually, the plastic chunks are what's taking up all the space. Um, power converters and scrap metal. <clears throat> That's it for the moment. Where in the Cataclysm is what? What you asking about? Alright, let's get the brazier built. So now we've got the ability to create fire. Um, let's... Set up over here. Okay, got our firewood source. Come on, all to there. Oops, where am I going? <laughs> going the wrong way. I think that'll do for the moment. Oh yeah, I need to go get some these thingies.
All right, so we got pretty good raw materials. Food and water is my next issue. Did I bring back any funnels? I don't remember if I picked any up. Didn't pick up any funnels for rainwater. Um, I also don't remember if there's water in the floor right below me. Let's have some fruit juice. Okay, so we got our fire source. Um, what else would I want him to do? No, not a giant bee. Before it gets too late, I want to head down to the forest real quick, do a little bit of scavenging. Whoa, whoa, oh my god, I just ran into a minefield. <laughs> uh, I am dead center, almost dead center in the middle of the minefield. I'm not sure what path I took to get in here, other than diagonally. I think I might have moved to the right one. <laughs> uh, well, hopefully we uh, don't die getting out of the minefield. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. All right, well, that was uh, a little more excitement than I needed. So, we have a minefield right close to us. It's really hard to see these things. Especially when you're fast moving when you really shouldn't be. Um, back to having no scaven or no survival skill. Dead things. Cougar corpse. Alright, now we've got food. Meat, awful fat bones. Whoops, clumsy butchering destroyed it. No, I need to get back before I lose the sight. I don't want to miss the uh, minefield. <laughs> hey there, minefield. That got laid a lot faster than I thought it would. But we brought back a bunch of meat, so that'll give me enough food that I can uh, do my reading. Alright, so yay, I'm happy to get this part done. Uh, lighter. Let's um, keep all that there. Just cook the meat. Cooking skill one, exciting. Uh, now I need more hydration. I'm really thinking of making one more trip down to get that uh, steel jerry can. It just holds so much water, so helpful. Yeah, I've never played uh, the ASCII version of Cataclysm. I can't imagine a minefield with ASCII. Um. Ah, uh, my onion and potato went rotten already. 
Let's have some rhubarb. Yeah, I turned my mini map off. I keep forgetting. <laughs> Remind me if I turn it off and you guys want to see it. I flip it off when I want to read more of the uh, combat log. Then I forget to turn it back on sometimes. All right, tired. I I'm gonna make that one more trip down. I I want that uh, steel jerry can. It's gonna help me out too much. And now I've forgotten that nice convenient route that I found <laughs> that uh, had the downstairs and upstairs close in those new areas. Ah, crap. Uh, I guess we'll go around again like I did last time. Take my hits from the stupid man hacks. Oh, no thank you. This is not a good combo. Little bastards. Hmm, he laid acid all through that little corridor there. Uh, I can't get out of that. You little bastard. <laughs> that was not friendly. Alright, I guess we'll just go through here. Uh, unexplored section. This is the one that's getting killed. I uh, need to get out of here quickly. Crap, I think this is my memory is fading on this level. That's not good. There's up. Why am I deaf? Hmm, not wearing my earplugs. Oh yeah, <laughs> don't like this room. Scientist corpse. <clears throat> Theater bot. Ah, they broke the door there. Uh, is this this is the level. All right, uh, straight north. God damn skitterbots! Things are everywhere. All right, that didn't give me much. <clears throat> Got my jerry can. Um. Much more convenient. That's right, right around there. Alright, can't go that way because of the smoke. This is the way I just was that I got ambushed. Leave me alone. Ooh, we killed it. I got all sorts of water right here. There, water's taken care of. Okay, so we got an easy water source. We've got our fire. We've got our sleeping area. We are set. Now I am much, much happier. Um, yeah, it's dropped right there. Oops. Do 
Do I have any gallon jugs? Let's dump the ammonia. Okay, fallen slaked, focus is okay, we're tired. Let's go ahead and sleep and then we'll start our reading binge. <clears throat> ah, focus is dropping. <laughs> Froze on me again. Yeah, make the atomic lamp. You failed. Yay, we have an atomic lamp. Technically, with the atomic lamp, I could set everything up in my bedroom now. <laughs> but we're not going to worry about it. Atomic lamp will be useful for later. Okay, let's get a fire going again. Okay, what are we going to read? Let's read Principles of Advanced Programming and then SICP. And do it away from the fire so we don't let it auto burn down. Go, book, go! Ah, stupid morale! <laughs> uh, I'm hot, I'm cold. Morale sucks. Focus is 24. How the hell? <sighs> okay, um, that was a really, really extreme switch. I thought my mood swing kicked in. Uh, do I not have mood swings anymore? Oh yeah, I still have chemical imbalance. I thought the chemical imbalance kicked in, and I got a big mood negative from that, but no, it's just a massive negative from the advanced programming book. Wow. Focus 24. Uh, alright. I guess I won't be able to do that much reading then. We only made it halfway. <sighs> no, I can't make the bone flute, I know that. I don't have a musical instrument. Uh, very little in the way of happy making food. Sure, have a Belgian ale. Hmm, that is going to be a problem. Guns and ammo will make me happy. I guess we'll read that. Focus is back up to 75. Mm, got that flipped a bit. Minus two fun factor. Come on, finish it. There we go. Computer six. Focus is 72, and we got the minus 30 debuff again, and we're tired again. Oh, it's going to take a lot of effort. 
and I think our water froze again. Um, I really, really, really would like to push the eight because then we can head downstairs and I have a lot more confidence about us getting into the uh, barracks and libraries and the uh, serum vaults. Problem is, the more time I spend up here, the memory of my levels is disappearing. Uh, SICP, it's not quite as negative fun factor as the other book. 51 minutes is a pretty long time, though. Yeah, we're getting frost nap. <laughs> hey, we actually made it to 7. Dead tired. That's pretty good timing. I'm going to keep it with me, and I'm going to probably have to... No, cooked meat's still good. Perfect. And water's still good. Okay, one more phase of that, and then we're going to head back downstairs. I need to hit all the vaults before I lose memory of all of the locations. I think if I sleep right now, it probably is going to lose a lot of it. Oh well. That's actually going to suck a lot, because I don't want to have to re-explore all these levels. Let's hop downstairs real quick. Eh, I can still see this level pretty well. Let's just hope. Hey, everything's frozen again. up some more meat. Hey Birdie, what you doing in here? Oh, that was the awful. Alright. Oh, that's gonna give me bad. No, oh, that's not good. Thought I was making cooked meat. And I'm tired again. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's my mood swings that's doing that to me. Alright. Chemical imbalance, I mean. Come on, please let me get stupid bird out of here. Stupid frostnip messages. I can't even see the percentages. And nah, I don't care. Frostnip me. 75. Oh no, too tired. Okay, okay. 88. Yeah, stop reading. How the hell did I drop my army helmet? That was weird. Uh, I didn't want to spend another day in here. We're at 88%, but I'm going to have to. Uh, I'm going to lose memory of all the stuff. It's going to suck. Asthma attack while I sleep. 
Uh, we gain light sensitive. Yeah, albino plus light sensitive. Uh, I don't like the direction that's going. Oh, and now we're very heat dependent. Yeah, I'm going to have to purify the hell out of this. This is not good. I'm going to start taking massive negatives. Yeah, 13% because I'm cold blooded. This is not good. Oh, we're carnivore too. <laughs> uh, hmm. Yeah, I'm uh I'm not sure what I'm going to do there. And I'm tired again. I'm <sighs> getting a little unhappy with that situation. Sleeping a long time, waking up and being immediately tired. <sighs> hmm. I have one purifier and it's not a serum. So that's not good. I'm going to finish reading before I do anything else. Come on, finish this thing. No! God! 96%! <laughs> 96% and it tells me no. Come on. Uh, I need to take another hit of uh, ale. Uh, yep, right there. Belgian ale. What else we got? It's great, I'm a carnivore now, so I can't eat a lot of my stuff. <laughs> uh... Alright, this mutation stuff starting to be a pain in my butt. Let's wait 30 minutes. Why do I keep dropping my damn hat? What is up with that? <laughs> How is that happening? Your army? Oh, oh, chitinous plate. I can't wear my hat, my hat anymore. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Uh, chitinous plate. You've grown a chitin exoskeleton made of thick, stiff plates. Provides excellent physical protection, but reduces your dexterity by one and encumbers all body parts but your eyes and mouth. Greatly reduces web of wet effects. Huh. Yeah, we're going full-on spider after that spider serum we took. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> It's starting to stack up into some pretty massive negatives. Uh, I can't wear my helmet anymore. Can I finish my book, please? 4%. One thing. Or more. Alright, computer's 8. We got what I wanted. Now we need to make a trip back down. I don't care that I'm tired. Let's get some more... Oh, crap, gotta start another fire. Let's activate the pots for cooked meat. Activate the pot for the clean water. Oops. Doesn't say I'm sated. Now I'm sated. All right. Um. Yeah. Seven point six out of thirty six with me using that stupid laundry basket still. Uh, I have no tailoring skill, right? Tailoring is zero. Alright, so I can't make a backpack yet. Alright, we're heading in. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So these don't lose in memory? I thought they faded away in memory. They get replaced if I go into another lab? How does that work? I guess I'm not understanding the mechanic. Okay, I want... Do not remember where I need to go. Yeah. 
Okay, nothing down here. I mark anything on here. Library. That's where we're going first. Let's try our computer eight against that library. Next one up and over. <laughs> Nukes! <laughs> Hey there, zombie scientist. Pretty sure I've been here, so this faded out. Alright. Bypass security, yes. Unlock, yes. Level 8. Unlock it. Quit. Come on, library. Give me some tailoring books. That's what I'm looking for. How to browse the web and a cookbook. <laughs> All right. Come on. What do you got for me? Computer Science 101. <laughs> Any other time, I'd be pretty happy to see that. Come on, tailoring books. Uh, they're not going to give me a tailoring book. Chemistry textbook, I already got that one. Circuit theory, electronics, I think I've got enough of that. And internal combustion. Another, I think, mechanics. Alright, oh well. We got a few decent books, but uh, not quite what I was looking for. So I got this library done. Is everything else? Yeah, it's fading. Uh, nah, I don't need funnels. Either cleaner bot. I'm worried about running, having to recheck for uh, turrets. Yeah, this definitely faded. Cyborg and a zombie. Don't care about a mini flamethrower. 